Fall quarter is in full swing at the U of O, and while ethnic enrollment is up, Latinos overall struggle to graduate. KEZI 9 News anchor Sean Cuellar takes a look at what some educational experts are calling a crisis. It's a new year for Francisco Morales O'Connor, a sophomore at the U of O. Both his parents were first-generation college graduates, a family trend that continues. My parents have always told me I'm going to go to college and get my master's degree. Francisco says it's an honor to study at the U of O, and with it comes responsibility. It makes me feel like I have a lot of power um, because there's not many Latinos that go to college. According to the 2010 census, Latinos and Hispanics make up 12% of Oregon's population, but that's not reflected in college enrollments. Latinos represented 8.3% of incoming freshmen at the U of O in the 2010-2011 school year, while only 5.8% of the total campus population. Then there's a the graduation rate. The National Education Association released a study indicating a crisis in the education of Latino students. In 2005, only 11.2% of Latinos ages 25 to 29 had completed a BA or higher. African Americans came in slightly higher at 17.5%, whereas whites, 34%. I think it's really alarming. I would really encourage high schoolers to do well in, in high school because a lot of universities like the University of Oregon have really great scholarship for minority students who come from low income backgrounds. For many families, money is an issue. The nonprofit Central Latino Americano started a scholarship program last year to assist Latino students at area colleges. Twelve students, including Francisco, received an award. This year, another 12 students will receive a scholarship. Juan Carlos Valle is a board member with Centro. He too attended the U of O. This is very important that we get behind these type of programs, not only for Latino students, African Americans, all students that are in need of these type of scholarships. Why? Because it is in our best interest for them to graduate so they can get into jobs, they can get involved in economic development, and they can secure a quality of life for tomorrow. For Francisco, his tomorrow includes a master's. I want to be a teacher, and I, I specifically would like to work with minority students. Those 12 scholarships will be awarded this Friday night as Central Latino Americano celebrates its 40th anniversary. At the U of O, Sean Cuellar, KEZI 9 News.